आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग गुड यू आर हेल्दी एंड स्टेइंग सेफ इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी द वेरियस करियर अपॉर्चुनिटीज आफ्टर इंजीनियरिंग मीन्स इट इज सीन दैट मेनी टाइम्स मोस्ट ऑफ द स्टूडेंट्स आर अन अवेयर ऑफ द अपॉर्चुनिटीज दे हैव इन फ्रंट ऑफ देम आफ्टर कंप्लीशन ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग दे जस्ट वॉन्ट टू प्रिपेयर फॉर एनी एग्जाम एंड जॉइन द गवर्नमेंट जॉब सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल बेसिकली टॉक अबाउट द वेरियस अपॉर्चुनिटीज विच एग्जिस्ट इन फ्रंट ऑफ द इंजीनियर्स सो दिस वीडियो इज बेसिकली हेल्पफुल फॉर सेकेंड थर्ड ईयर एंड फाइनल ईयर स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग आफ्टर गोइंग थ्रू दिस वीडियो यू विल बी एबल टू एनालाइज योर सेल्फ विद विच government job you would like to join in future after completion of engineering and maybe it will act as a direction for you so the first we'll see the technical part means what are the opportunities in technical field so as you can see the first opportunity which is there is your higher studies that is post graduation if what you can do you can do me mtech in one ms also from foreign universities in our iits also there is one uh, option of doing integrated mtech and phd so this is the very basic opportunity you have that is for going uh, to higher studies so admission to me mtech is through gate examination as you might be aware and if you want to study in foreign universities then you will have to go through uh, this gre and toefl all those exams so here below i have uh, given some Uh, playlist youtube channel playlist uh, i request you to kindly go through this playlist to make yourself aware of, uh, about this uh, mem tech preparation the second important uh, thing is your indian engineering services which is called as ias so in indian engineering services it is basically conducted for four branches that is uh, mechanical engineering electronics and telecommunication engineering electrical engineering and civil engineering so the students from these four branches have a very good opportunity for writing this ias examination after clearing this exam you will be joining as a group a officer to the technical posts of government of india so this is one of the prestigious exam which uh, engineers try every year next important Uh, opportunity is your staff selection commission junior engineer examination as you might be aware uh, uh, ssc je is conducted every year to recruit junior engineers to central government departments like uh, border roads organization central water commission etc so the youtube channels which i have shared above even those are helpful for your ssc je preparation so you can think of this opportunity then the uh, fourth is trainee engineers in psus through gate examination as you know that uh, gate is conducted every year in the month of february uh, so through this gate examination many psus are recruiting their trainee engineers every year so you can see more than 25 psus recruit trainee engineers through gate examination so some of the prominent psus as you can see is ntpc bhel iocl hpcl bpcl ongc etc so all these psus recruit trainee engineers every year through this gate examination so if you have very good go gate score there is a chance that you can get selected in this premier organizations fifth is your junior engineer in indian railways indian railways also conducts its own examination for recruiting junior engineer but this exam is not held every year it is held uh, say at the interval of every 2 3 years uh, when the vacancy arises so this is also one of the good opportunities for uh, engineers then we have isro drdo and bar that is baba atomic research center so you might be aware isro conducts its own examination every year for selection of entry level scientist engineer and in that the eligibility criteria is uh, 65% aggregate in b btech is required so the, keep this thing in mind that you should possess more than 65% aggregate if you have to appear for this isro written examination 
Similarly, DRDO conducts preliminary screening through gate examination and then con conducts mains examination on their own. That is, primary shortlisting is through gate examination and then DRDO conducts its own mains examination for shortlisting candidates for interview. So, DRDO is also one of the premier organization uh, to work with and then we have this uh, BARC also. So, BARC who conducts its own examination for recruitment of scientific officers. So, these are some of the opportunities in central government. Now, what uh, about state government? In state government, say for example, Maharashtra, you have these examinations, say junior engineer, assistant engineer in water resources department, PWD through Maharashtra Engineering Services. So, these examination is also conducted by our uh, public service commission that is MPSC as and when vacancy arises so this is also one of the good opportunity for an engineer similarly for other states also this post will be uh, there next is your assistant motor vehicle inspector examination the students call it as RTU inspector so this examination is also conducted by MPSC as and when vacancy arises and the last opportunity I would say is working as a junior research fellow grf in iits or cesir on the basis of gate examinations means you will be experiencing the research environment in these premier institutes and you will be paid stipend for that so the selection for this is on the basis of gate examination now we will see the other opportunities where any degree is the eligibility so the first and most important is your civil services examination uh, in this CSE examination uh, any degree is eligibility means uh, not only engineers may doctors and other science commerce background students also appear so as you might be aware it is for the selection of post of IS IPS IFS IRS and other group A and group B gadgeted posts of government of India. So this examination is conducted every year by UPSC. So this is one of the golden opportunity if you are planning to serve in non-technical posts. Then we have Indian Forest Service examination which is called as IFOS. So this examination is also conducted by UPSC every year. Third we have combined defense services examination. If you want to join Indian Army, Air Force or Indian Navy as an officer. So this is one of the good opportunity means if you want to serve in defense forces then this examination is conducted every year by UPSC and the important thing is it is held twice in a year remember this you, are, you get two opportunities in a year to write this examination then we have this CAPF Central Armed Police Forces CAPF so this examination is also conducted by UPSC every year who wish to join paramilitary forces so you might be knowing that BSF, CISF, CRPF, ITBP then this Sashastra Seema Bal these are our paramilitary forces and in these forces examination is conducted for recruiting assistant commandant every year so it is a group A gadgeted post so it is also one of the good opportunity for an engineer next we have is your combined graduate level examination that is CGL so combined graduate level examination is conducted by staff selection commission for recruitment of group B and group C post in various ministries and departments of government of India so many a times it is seen that the most number of students write this examination uh, in our country since it also has very good reputation and you will be straight away working with the various ministries and departments in government of India at state level we have our state services examination which we call at Rajya Seva examination plus you have this PSI that is police sub inspector then you have state uh, your tax inspector examination then ASO that is a uh, desk officer assistant section officer all these examination are conducted by MPSC every year so it is for the selection to the post of deputy collector DYSP assistant commissioner of GST then Tehsildar police sub inspector then this STI states tax inspector then assistant section officer 
so those who are planning to write mps examination can consider uh, these posts and finally we have these banking exams it is one of the most important exams conducted in our country where many engineers apply every year to work with uh, nationalized banks so this exam is conducted by ibps then sbi also conducts its own examination and even reserve bank of india also conducts its own examination for recruitment of probationary officers and clerical cadre posts in various banks so you can also apply for these banking exams also since uh, you will be very, getting very good opportunity to serve the customers or public at large so this is all about the various opportunities which is there in front of you after you graduate from any engineering stream so if you have any doubt please let us know in the comment section and we have various telegram channels like for upsc this is our telegram channel if you are preparing for mpsc then this is our telegram channel and if you are a student of mechanical engineering then this is our telegram channel so according to your preparation you can join any one of the telegram channels for future updates